A couple of articles ago on my blog, um, I wrote about search engine optimization and using keywords for your dental practice. And I said that those keywords need to appear in as many places as possible on the website. Um, if you can get them into the uh, web address itself, um, that's always a good starter. You need to get them into the browser title. You need to get them into the headers, the H1 headers, which are the main big, he large head um, headers of a website. You need to get them into the text of the website. You need to bold them in the text of the website and use them as the um, alternative text um, that we put into images. So that's just a few ways that we can optimize an individual page on a website. But don't think that you can optimize a website. You optimize a page on a website. So each of your pages on your website needs to be optimized for a different word. So it'd be very, very difficult to get one single page on a website that talks about whitening, veneers, and Invisalign to appear top of a search engine for all of those searches. So you need to have individual pages for each of those areas, and then those individual pages can talk about whitening Lightning, another one about Invisalign, um, and another one about orthodontics, another one about CEREC, and so on and so forth for the practice. But what I want to talk about here are variances on the same keyword. So you really should be having your dental practice come up uh, near the top of the searches for search terms like dentist in and then your geographical location. So I live in Rickmansworth, so if I wanted my website to appear for um, dentist in Rickmansworth, I need to make sure that that term, dentist in Rickmansworth, is used in the, the header tags, in the alternate text for the images, in the text itself, and that it's bolded. But also, there are other permutations that people may search. They may not search for dentist in Rickmansworth. Now, the search engines don't always take plurals um, to be the same as the singular. So dentist in Rickmansworth is a different search to dentists in Rickmansworth, as is dental practice in Rickmansworth. So if you highly optimize your site for one search word term, like dentist in Rickmansworth, you are not going to appear top of the searches for dental practice in Rickmansworth. And the truth is, is that people use all those different permutations of the same search, ultimately to search for the same thing. So the only way to find out is to do keyword searches using Google's keyword search tool, is to use another resource called wordtracker.com, which is a, a subscription-based service, and it will give you the different permutations on the search word. And then you need to make sure that you optimize your website for um, a multitude of keywords based around the same theme. So dentist in Rickmansworth, dentists in Rickmansworth, dental practice in Rickmansworth, Rickmansworth dental practice because that is a different search word even though the words are all there they're in a different sequence um, so you need to be making sure that you use those different texts within your website and restructure the way you say things um, and the way you bold things and the way you use things in header um, um, and the headers of the website to include those various um, ways of saying the same thing.